no matter how many films you've done, it never stops being so much bloody fun, riding on a horse, slashing through people, having some fights, you know? I mean, it's, that's, that's straight back to being eight years old. Within the, the, the macro of, of uh, the, the battle scenes, there needs to still be the micro of the detail of the relationships because Ridley is someone who doesn't just say, oh, well, here's a battle scene. It's, it's a battle scene that's also telling a story. And it's a very important story that, that uh, the Battle of Kadesh uh, between us and the, the fulfillment of a prophecy and the beginning of a severance of the two brothers. So I really love those battle scenes because it's a chance to play boys club and, and fashion yourself as the hero that you always dreamed and wished you were. But it's also your chance to uh, add extra uh, garnish on, the, on the, the story, which is the human story. You have two men who are grown up in a very fascist society where they are the top dogs, um, where they get to enjoy every indulgence that man uh, has to offer. And my relationship uh, with, with Moses is that we've been raised somewhat as brothers, but essentially Ramesses feels that Moses is his cousin. Chris and I were fighting back to back, you know, because really do these really long takes with 10 cameras. And we were like killing like eight or nine people each. And it took like two, two minutes, probably only 45 seconds to be right. honest. And there's the two of us. It, felt like, it felt like 45 <laughs> minutes. Oh, God, God. You realise how hard a real battle would be. Right, my, 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 my herniated disc. Oh my yeah. God, am I going to get through it? <laughs> Makes you think, you know, in real battles through history, you think, oh, they would have gone on for hours. And then, no, no you do that and you go. exhausted. Just the armour walking up a hill, mm. you're done. By the end of that, you'd feel done. like a battle would be you know, like these two poor bastards long. who were sent into war, and and you know, yeah, it would have been very quick. Uh, death would have been very quick. That the camels had a special relationship with Aaron Paul. What they uh, needed to um, discharge um, was something that uh, made his um, moustache come flying off. <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's what it was. It was fantastic to watch. Fine. Trying to cross the Red Sea with Joshua dry heaving yeah. all the way. <laughs> Me being cruel, sending camel poop his way just to watch what happened. <laughs> and then with his dry heaving, his moustache coming flying off as well. <laughs> it was fantastic. It's really a battle of ethics. And the action of the, the movie, yeah, we have a great battle scene early on, but it's not a conventional like battle after battle after battle. The battles are the detail of the struggle and the, the uprising and the revolution that, that Moses starts. The interesting machinations of a battle that is as much about ethics as it is about the uprising. You know, Ridley's wonderful ability of cradling the massive scale of things in this human story that bring the spectacle. Ultimately, what we're doing, we're reaching out to people. None of it matters unless you're actually reaching out and managing to get into people's hearts and minds and make them feel something.